Hello, Commanders. I'm Atlantic Pixel. I'm currently at Hudson Orbital after doing the community goal to unlock those fabulous mugs, which are not yet actually in the game, but they soon will be. I think a few people hung around for a while to see if they'd uh, appear, but then it uh, was real revealed that they uh, wouldn't be. So, yeah. Anyway, that's the last time I played, hence why I'm here. Now, this is just a quick update video. I'm gonna set my course for my new home system and I'll uh, just talk about what's been going on. First of all, the main reason for this video is that whilst it might not sound like a lot, I've now reached uh, 100 subs on this channel, which is lovely, actually. Um, you know, yeah, it might not sound like a, uh, a lot to some people, but to me, it's a lot. And thank you for watching these videos. I um, I try to put a lot of effort into them, which is probably why I don't get as many out as possible. But I'm going to try and change that. I'm going to mix the format up a bit. I think try and make things a bit more efficient um, without trying to lose the quality. Um, hopefully, anyway. And I've got a few more ideas for some different types of videos. Um, I'm now going to be a part of the beta program when Horizons hits. I haven't been involved in any of the beta for this game so far. But I decided for Horizons I wanted to be and hopefully I'll do some videos prior to Horizons release about the different features and I'm very excited about that. I mean, who wouldn't be excited about landing on planets? That's awesome. Even if it is just rocky, you know, uninhabited kind of planets, it's still going to be blooming amazing. So, yeah. Bolg is an interesting system name. Yeah, so that's what's going to be coming up. I mean, next week we have uh, CQC open to all players as part of the Mayhem event, which is just a big kind of open beta test, if you like, without calling it that. And that's going to be sweet. I'm going to do some CQC videos. Can't wait for that. I've not really been interested in it until recently, and I watched a few videos and thought, you know what? It, it kind of... It's a different style of PvP than, than you get in this game. You know, it makes it a lot more interesting, I think. You know, flying around stations and asteroids, and because you you feel like that's the way the game should be already, but in reality, when you dogfight, it's just not not like that. So I am looking forward to that. It's going to be cool. Um, yeah, and there's a few other events uh, as part of Mayhem that Frontier want want everyone to do, and I haven't yet decided what to do with my group, but. I want to organise some stuff. Now, in terms of my group, um, we were called Delcar Company. We were backing the existing faction. And because of recent events, a mixture of things, re uh, really, but recent events have meant that us, you know, staying in control. I mean, we didn't have any control of that group anyway. You know, it's an in-game faction. But the fact that... Um, player groups are going to be put into the game, which is, you know, been happening over the last couple of months. You know, the planning stage of it, anyway. Uh, the fact that when that was announced, and I got really excited about it, um, then discovered that you could be affiliated with an in-game group in whatever sense that would be in-game, which, you know, you wouldn't have that much control over it, but you could be affiliated, but... It would, it would only be temporary, it wouldn't last very long, and I just thought, well, that kind of sucks. So, we decided that um, we would move. Move to a new system and change our name. So we've basically sold our shares in the company. We've, we've uh, researched a new location, and that is where I'm heading right now. Back to uh, my new HQ. Uh, we are now called Titan Industries. Our gameplay style is the same. Still a kind of extraction, 
uh, commerce and security company. Uh, we are still accepting employees if you uh, want to come play. And we, you know, our gameplay style is still the same as it was. We are, um, you know, it's all about the business. All about the business. We tax players for for trading and mining in our space. And we, you know, as part of that tax, it's uh, it gives players um, our security uh, services. Um, so it's not, you know, it's not like we're code, but you know, business is business, right? We're also going to be operating in other mining locations and other places across civilized space. Um, CGs specifically. We're going to bring our play style to CGs and just kind of mix things up a bit, make things interesting, which will be nice. Yeah, so I'll put the link to the website in the description if you want to go have a look at our new site, which is an engine website. If you want to come uh, and join, feel free. There's uh, so much I'm looking forward to in this game. I mean, I have to power play hit. I mean, you may you may have noticed if you'd watched one of my previous videos about power play. Um, I kind of got a bit downhearted about the game, kind of it wasn't quite what I wanted it to be anymore and I've had that totally totally twisted upside down I'm now like really passionate about it again I've, I'm very excited about the things that are going to come so I'm you know I'm ready for Horizons I can't wait for it and I'm excited about the fact that our player group it should be put into the game I'm not sure if it'll be in the first wave of groups we had our rank, you know, we're, we're still a small group of only 20 plus players. Um, each group has a kind of different, different, uh, I guess, level of feedback they can get from Frontier, different level of communication. I mean, the larger player groups can, can get in on Skype calls with community managers and stuff like that. And I don't really know in what, what way that will benefit them. You know specifically, but um, but yeah, they they can be more involved anyway, and that's that's what I want to do. But you know, small group, so can't really can't really help that at the minute anyway. But yeah, we've had our ranking, and hopefully, we'll be the first wave of player groups put into the game. I did register really early on. But, you know, it's not the end of the world if it's not in this first wave. We'll, we'll get in eventually, I'm sure. Unless there's uh, someone else vying for the same system. Which will make things interesting. We have a PvP at our own doorstep. Uh, we'll go with the flow. Yeah, so in terms of video formats. You know, a lot of my videos are fairly heavily edited. And they, they take a long time to edit as well it's very time consuming and I've decided that I need to be a bit more efficient with what I do so I'm going to bring out the same kind of videos you know the Tales from the Black series which are kind of in character in character things which I I like to do because it's a role-playing game and I like to play it in character and you know it's part of the sandbox experience so I'm gonna to continue to do that but I'm probably gonna pull back the editing a bit and I imagine I'm also gonna be doing a lot more um, out of character stuff or well, not necessarily out of character but kind of a uh, less traditional stuff where you know I just record certain events that you know no building a story around it or anything just you know game events do short videos about whatever um, I want to do some racing videos um, 
that's something I need to organise and uh, talk to fellow YouTuber about because I want to do a collaboration on that because I think that'd be pretty sweet. Um, and yeah, CQC videos. You know, there's not really much story behind that, but I'll I want to do quite a few of those as well. And uh, yeah, and then my story series will continue, uh, which will get a lot more interesting hopefully with Horizons. There's a uh, you know like. I don't really do tutorial videos, and there's a lot of people that do do good tutorial videos already. Um, but I might do some. I'm not sure what. I might do like some interesting ship builds, maybe something like that. Um, I'm decided, but maybe, maybe we'll see. We'll see. Well, I've reached my new home system. And uh, it's my new HQ. Killach, Killach, Vision, Killach, Killer, Killer, Killach, Vision. Who knows how it's pronounced? That is one of the problems of ED. There's a lot of systems, and no one knows how to pronounce. A lot of star star ports that no one knows how to pronounce. But I'm gonna say Killer, Killer Vision. That's uh, what I'm calling this anyway. This is the uh, Avicali system. Titan Industries new HQ. Uh, this is just well I say above Alliance Space but you know <laughs> ab Ooh. well screw that we're gonna do a bit of a uh, bit of combat why not I was gonna land and end the video but screw it we're going with the flow yeah, that fight didn't go too well, so I ran away. I've got new key bindings, which I haven't learnt yet. And I'm also using my HOTUS for the first time in about two months, because I've been using Xbox One controller while I've been away. Um, and this Python is also not set up for combat. Because um, I was maximising my... Um, my cargo capacity for the HUT and CG. So, yeah, I gave that, gave it a go, but that was not a successful fight, so. <laughs> so I've gone. Anyway, can't remember my bloody, there we go. Yeah, my key bindings are really complicated now, they're different, because I had to totally rebind my HOTAS today. I decided to try out a new setup, and I've not learnt it, so that also did not help. Anyway. Killer Vision. This is our new HQ. Lovely. Yeah, so that's it really. Just a little video about me, I guess. Me, me, me. But yeah, thank you again for subscribing and I hope to keep making some you know, some videos that you enjoy watching. That's, you know, I enjoy making videos. I enjoy Elite. You know, I love Elite. And, you know, it's, you know, I'm, I'm glad some people like watching my stuff. So please keep doing so. I'll keep trying to make things that are worth watching. Not including this video, obviously. But, you know. Not every video can be a uh, Oscar winning you know, production or whatever. Anyway. Here I am. Practice my landing with my HOTUS the first time in a while. Xbox One controller is so awkward to use, I find. Like, very awkward to use. I find this a lot more pleasant. Yeah. There we go. What a, uh, a lovely trip. I'm sure you all uh, enjoyed watching me do that. Anyway, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. See you in the black. Oh.